email to and from the compost center and myself. All right, and in this email, you state, in regard to the burn pit, our involvement began with a request to use our sensory tank. The scene has obviously been altered at that point. Okay. And then, do you want to read the next sentence, please? Had we been working on the instrument, there would likely have been more thorough photo records done by us. However, under the circumstances, we are merely able to provide technical assistance rather than complete the scene process. Well, typically, if you're called to the scene to process potential evidence, you're able to do so from start to finish. I'd say in the majority of cases, when we arrive at the scene, we are given over control. We take the lead. Your knowledge of Mr. Fasten is all uh, forensic anthropologist at the burn pit. And this area, this area that was excavated was about how big? Tell you roughly the size of the table and three. And when you would bring over a shovel here or a shovel there, nobody kept track of where exactly in that area any particular suspected bone may have been, right? No. Everything that was collected in this area was placed together in a box. This area being that four by five feet, four by five foot ash pile <coughs> together in a box. There was no systematic approach to the collection of 